Hey y'all, Irix guy here. Now, if you've got the uh, the RX100 Mark IV, and you can check the link within this video's description if you don't, you know it just comes with a uh, with a wrist strap, which in my opinion is not optimal because it's you know I mean obviously it'll go around your wrist, but it's one of those things that when you're getting it in and out of your pocket, whoa 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 whoa, hey 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 hey, nope nope nope, got to shoot this video. Sean Coonery. No, no, no. See, he agrees this is not optimal uh, for the camera. So what we're going to do is I found a, uh, I found another strap. It's a neck strap that is made out of a very long-lasting material. So we're just going to take this off. It's, it's easy on, easy off, as you can see. It's just got a little hole there. So I'm going to take off the factory Sony one. And you can find a link to this within this video's description. It's actually a Canon product, but it's made out of this uh, metal material. Let's see, it says it's made out of, uh, well, it just says metal neck strap. So this is something when the camera's in use or not in use, it can still be around my neck. And then that way I'm less likely to drop it, taking it in and out of the pocket, you know, like I would do with, uh, with the wrist strap. But you can see here, unlike most neck straps that go on on each side, this just goes on on one side. So it's it's very easy to install. So we're going to put it on this side of the camera. Simply going to loop this through here. And then once that's looped through, we're going to pull this end through. And boom, there we go, it fits perfectly. So now we've got a neck strap that only has to go on one side of the camera. So it's not like the one where it's looped over. And this is better, especially if you're doing videos or something, because this, since this is made out of metal, it's kind of heavy. So it likely won't go in front of the, um, in front of the lens if you're filming from a tripod, etc. So it's a really nice, really nice design in my opinion. And obviously, when you're not carrying it and you've got it in your uh, your travel backpack, etc., you can see it's very compact. So it's not going to take up a lot of room, and it's it's definitely not heavy. It's it's heavy construction, but it's not heavy to uh, to carry around. And it's metal on the inside, but it feels like it has like a clear uh, plastic type coating coating rather. So it it seems feels really comfortable. So I thought I'd share this video again. Check the link within this video's description. You can find where to order it, uh, as well as the uh, the Mark IV, the batteries, tripod, and other accessories that I use for the uh, for the Mark IV. Really amazing camera for such a super small size. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. YouTube.com forward slash Irix Y'all have a good day.